Hello everyone. You may or may not know that I just uh, finished celebrating a birthday this past week. And when you're 70, you get to do a lot of silly things that a lot of people wouldn't think of doing. I've had this outfit for quite a while and I haven't been able to use it, but my birthday kind of came around and swung into a Scottish kind of a routine. I uh, got many great gifts. I've got a plane ride coming up this spring in a 1947 Stearman biplane, uh, books to read, uh, gift certificates for golf, and uh, one other gift that uh, my daughter Sue came up with that uh, I'm wondering if it will make a big change in my life and how you all perceive me. I hope it doesn't, but it probably will. But I've become a landowner in Scotland. And according to Scottish law, I can be called Lord. So from here on in, all you folks, all you commoners, should be calling me Lord Robert of Glencoe. Now, I know that doesn't sound like much to you people, but uh, when you've attained that height of, uh, of the seniority or whatever, you get these little gifts thrust upon you and... Uh, I hope you enjoy it as much as I, and I know it's true because I got a certificate that says Lord Robert Calvin Murphy, or otherwise known as the Laird. So please, I'm asking you to uh, offer a little respect when you see me the next time. Not, not anything out of control, but just recognizing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one of my other gifts, 12-year-old Scotch of Macallan, and I'm going to pour a little dram for me, because I'm here and it's mine, and I'm going to do whatever I want to, and I'm going to mix a little bit. you got to cut this. This is thanks to Edward, my friend in Scotland, and Edinburgh told me to uh, cut it a little bit with some water. So as I do this, I hope you're all in good health. And just remember, this changes nothing just simply because you are all commoners and I'm a landowner in Scotland. So, shalom zava. Boy, that's better than a Budweiser, I'll tell you that. <laughs>